Langer and Sonny Sarcite will tip things off. Here this afternoon, the tip is won by North Dakota and we're underway. Good recovery by Omad and then Mayo fires well off the mark. Made him catch it at the high post. Oh, great mark. How about that? He's trying to gut it out, but he's still clearly bothered with that angle as Sarcite. Player set to check in as Detlinger pulls up. Hit out Danielson. Corner three on the way and well set up there by Eagles Oh man, I tell you what, when you got a freshman that can shoot it and then do something like that. With South Dakota State paying attention to Alex Arians after he looked like he help. It's you know, help is one thing, but early help is better. <laughs> Seemed like my team's had late help, but <laughs> Omot right around Mayo, bullying his way to the rim. And two fingers singled up again. Moore's trying to maneuver around Levias, and, and he's yes, able to finish. Yes, yes, yes. And he dumps it off, and Brooks able to finish at the rim plus the foul. Sarcize is going to pull up for a three, and that's off the mark. Time, but you're you're going to get some good looks. There's a tough shot and a pull up from the block day by Sarcize. Now the freshman will try to go to work. Kyle. Rising up, boy, that is a from Eagle Staff with another turnover. Mims, Kyle there to clean it up. Trapped underneath the rim, but he powers it up anyway. Back-to-back -back buckets has. Sarcize from the free throw line over Kyle puts an end to the run from South Dakota State. Turned it over on the kickout. Mayo gonna fly in for the lay-in, and South Dakota State continuing to force the issue. And taking advantage, they surrounded, spinning on lean and able to get it with the left hand. Great counter move. Tesla is going to fire a three, and that's a little bit short. Rebound tipped, and now Eagle Staff attacking on the other end with the left hand. I mean, he's always been a great post coach, and you can tell his guys uh, wall up well defensively. Experience trying to find space, rising up in the lane. Oh, great poise. I mean, it's right where you start. You got to. You got to start getting the ball in there, maybe a little bit more, and then get your threes on kickouts like that. Oh, Mayo. Eagle staff right now as Sark sees a roll to the bucket. Two more free throws coming up. Who are they going to? Norman, clean look all day for three. Oh, and that was offensive transition. South Dakota State did not. Being, you know. Danielson, clean look. Another kick out from Trent, and a timeout for South Dakota State. It's an all time record at SDSU. This is also his 139th game. I mean, that is a lot of college. <laughs> Jacks have some numbers. Kyle on the attack, had to put on the brakes. Uh, I tell you what, though, what a great defense. Another great defensive play by Kyle. Kick out, Mayo clean, look for three, oh, no. Good. A little set play coming out of halftime. Mims fires a three. Arians good. Uh, a foul. Well, and that's up. Denlinger slams it down. And South Dakota State on a quick 7-0 spurt. North Dakota still scoreless. Norman attacking, finally got a bucket to drop. Arians stepping back, three on the way, yes! Possibly is when you get good looks. Matt Norman! Norman couldn't handle it cleanly, would have had a clean look for three. Levias instead will fire and connect. It's against North Dakota State as Arians answers right back with a three. Shooting very well from three overall, but, oh, okay, well, I mean, I don't know. They keep an eye on Arians because they know what he can do in the second half. Was Get into a rhythm. Oh, and he's, he, that's tough for On the run, has Dentlinger with him. Dentlinger on the attack, got it. Really going to that screen roll game. Kyle with the left, got the shooter's touch. I mean, eight minute mark, or 12 minute mark. Dentlinger for the lead, yes! Quick release and went up strong. Mims for three, oh, it's... Starting all full now. Well, for isn't SDSU. it amazing, Brian, when you get stuff at the rim and the ball? Another North Dakota turnover. That's their eighth this half. Mayo again for three. Oh, boy! North Dakota turnover. Mayo, no. Put back, Denlinger. Another screen roll game, poise. Mims. Oh, boy, the avalanche continues to fall as it's a 20 to 2 run. Sarcize tries to answer, and finally one drops for Silton. Well, let's run. Yeah, they're capable, and, uh, you know. Dentlinger found some space. Up over the top of Sarcize. Poise. Boy, the experience really starting to show up here for the Jacks. Dentlinger up to 14. Arians has 12. Mayo has 14. You need your horses to deliver, and they are. Yeah, they are, and they just, they, they're running that 
little ball screen continuity, and they're just getting so many good things out of it. Start C20 left. There you go, one of two at the stripe. Seven at this point is really good, and as we speak, And I think they're gonna call a tie-up before the tie on the Jacks here in the second half. Olmott fouled by Moores, and that'll be a one and one coming up to convert these to get back every opportunity. And convert chance to make this a one possession game on this trip. Danielson trying to maneuver around Dentlinger. Got him oh, up in great the air. Move. And four of six at the line against South Dakota. He's had his issues at the line, just 45% on the same. Time around too. Hits them both, and it's a one. Mayo shaking and baking on Trent. Another oh, one. ball's loose. Turned over. Tie up. We'll stay with SDSU with wow. five on the shot clock. How big a play from. And because of Kyle's effort to get on the floor, SDSU gets the ball back. Man, what a play. When you have a short period of time to do it. Well, North Dakota looks left for dead, trailing by as many as 11, but in a 10-0 run over the last 3.07, holding. Okay, so John Yorkovich. Green screener action. Oh, Kyle wow. got great position, and he looked to help UND to get back into the game. They had zero turnovers. Fighting Hawks do have one. Norman around Mayo, lost it, foul is called. You want to stress the defense. You want to make the defense. Big spot here uh, for Matt Norman. Norman. Norman's been a <laughs> Rattles it in. In position, they were in on Thursday when Cruz Piero Hunt, Mayo 14 points, but just five of 18 shooting. Nine rebounds, six steals, four assists. Matt Mims has hit some with five. And a foul is going to be called. On Sortney Sortzidze with 2.9. Came crashing, it could have been maybe a charge too. Uh, I don't know, he kind of slid in, you know. True yeah. freshman. He seems pretty comfortable in these situations. Left it short. And of course, oh. that's what happened. That one looks good, and it is. Uh, got some set up right now. Here comes Trent. Norman to get it. Down to two. Norman from half court for the win. No! And South Dakota State escapes with a 60 to 59 victory. Well, I tell you, uh, 